everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Emma and Georgia and today we are watching Stranger Things Season 3 Episode 5. If you want to watch our uncut Steve reactions, link to the Patreons down below. Last episode, the gang captured Billy inside the sauna at the swimming pool because they figured out that he is possessed and yeah. he put on a really good act at first he acted like he was really sorry and apologizing to max and i think we both fell for it but I, I i believe it was just an act and the mind player they managed to draw the mind player out with the heat and mm. he completely yeah. bust that door open and came up and started throttling eleven holding her up by her neck Thankfully, Mike stepped in and whacked him and did something to help because everyone else is just standing there really gormlessly. Um, I think everyone was just in shock. They didn't know what to do. <laughs> yeah. It looks like the Mind Flayer was draining the life out of Mrs. Driscoll, poor old Mrs. Driscoll, in order to give Billy more power, which maybe yeah. gives a reason as to why he's creating this army so that he can use the energy from one person and transfer it to another and mm. I assume Mrs. Driscoll is dead now because that was a whole lot of, oh my god, oh, I've just suddenly got the visions. She was like going all veiny and blistery from where her insides were coming out because of how much force was being taken out of her. So oh, yeah, I think she must be dead. <laughs> yeah, I think when it's survival of the fittest, you look at Mrs. Driscoll and you look at Billy, it's sort of a no brainer for the mind player. It's sort yeah. of like, yeah, I'll take Billy. Um, if he's only she'd get the been chosen done. as the main one. <laughs> <laughs> it would be, but it could have been kind of smart because it's so inconspicuous. Like mm. you wouldn't expect a cute little old lady to hold so much demon in her. So yeah, it's, it's sad, rest in peace. But yeah, Billy is gonna be stronger than ever, and it was it was really deja vu with Will when you know Joyce, the crew were there trying to exercise this demon inside Will with the he, and he started saying things to Joyce, were like, "Oh, Mom, don't do this to me," and "Oh, it hurts so bad," and "Why are you doing this?" And Billy was doing the exact same thing. I, I think felt it's like, like this it was easier to tell though when it wasn't really Will when he was at yeah. Home. It was. You could tell when he'd shifted back into his, like, you know, mind flayer mind. Um, but that's Billy, probably it's... because Billy's a lot more villainous. Morally corrupt. <laughs> yeah. So we didn't, we don't really know if he has much of a softer side to really believe it. Yeah. But I mean, I did believe it. At the end, we saw that Heather had brought the whole army of the undead. And there's a lot of people in town that have been flayed and are now part of this army. A whole lot happened off screen that we didn't know about, so they've got quite the army now. Um, Joyce and Hopper were investigating the abandoned lab and they ran into this old... No, not he wasn't old. He was very young and sprightly because he <laughs> beat Hopper to a pulp almost. It turns out he's this Russian guy who is blackmailing the mayor because they, the Russians seem to have bought Starcourt Mall and are storing things there, to quote him, and they're bribing him to do something, we don't know what. Dustin, Robin, Steve and Erica, the new member of the gang, went to investigate there. Erica climbed through the vents and came in the secret room. Turned out that it was filled with this slimy green substance that they were storing there and it was an elevator which seemed to drop or start going at the end of the episode. So we'll see where they end up and if they're in one piece. Yeah, that, that whole scene was really scary with the lift. Unexpected and poor Erica didn't sign up for this. She just wants her free share of ice cream. You know, like the girls innocent in all this. Um, and it is Lucas's sister, isn't it? Like, mm -hmm. he doesn't even realise that his sister's sort of in on this now. It's just funny to watch. I love that they decided to give her more of a role then, cause, though, because she's always been really oh, funny yeah. with her one-liners. Oh god, go back to the lift! <laughs> it's so fast. <laughs> I would be pissing my pants if I was them. I like how Eric is literally the one responsible here. Steve is pissing himself. You would have thought the Russians would have built a bit of a stable lift. 
Is everyone okay? Yeah, I'm great now that I know that Russians can't design elevators. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> if those buttons don't work. If you don't have a key card, it won't operate. Meaning we're stuck in here. Are you serious? I did think about that. Where does the vent go now? I would be a bit wary of this oh, before the other comes back God. up. Oh. Wishes you all. What were you saying about climbing? Oh, screw this. I wouldn't have the energy for that. I love the filming of that though. That's so cool. Looks like somebody's home. I also love that Hopper's attire of the season has changed. She's probably going to spend the rest of it in this Hawaiian oh. shirt. <laughs> this is worrying. Whose house is it? Oh, There's a under. vent under the bed. Well, it might be a basement. It's below us. Does it lift up the bed and then there's a door? Oh. Yep. You were right. Oh, hell no. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Russian guy's back and we need to skedaddle. Hey, dipshit. <gasps> that that guy with the glasses is the mentor, isn't he? You speak English? I wonder if he's warning them to get out of there. Has he got a massive gun? Oh. He came with weps. Oh. Oh, hello. You understand what I'm saying, big guy? Probably not. <laughs> but what? So you do understand what I'm saying, huh? And yeah, you don't put that thing away, I'm gonna blow some daylight into that thick skull of yours. No. <coughs> Policemen have rules. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't put it past this guy. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past Hopper. Two, three. Oh. 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 Hopper actually, he actually shot. was going to do it though. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my god, no. they could hit anyone doing that. They really do not care about their star. No, of course not. They have one goal and that's it. Collateral damage. <laughs> oh god, this guy's owning Hopper right now. We need to. He's out of his depth here. He's not as young and agile. <laughs> I know. Oh, what was my that? god. <laughs> Joyce! Oh my god, he's just tied him to him! Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> this guy gives no fucks. Joyce, please! Joyce! Joyce! This guy is Joyce! Joyce proved herself to be a bit of a fumbler in that situation. I know. She'll, she'll get some more training. She's a work experience. I'm at the hospital with Driscoll. What? She's been sedated for a few hours. My doctors are so ready. She's still Nancy, going. Please tell me you're joking. It's not a joke. I need you to put me on the phone. It's your brother. What? Jonathan, please. Where is he? Is he safe? Why wouldn't he be safe? <laughs> she don't worry when he's not home anymore. <laughs> they, they don't give a shit anymore. The magnetized stop working. I, I, do you understand? No. Okay. So oh right, does. <laughs> Duh. Okay. Machina. Machina. You learned that Smirnov over there. Alexei. Smirnov is Russian and works for Starcourt. Two uh, things we already knew. He is in a bad mood. I feel like something's gonna blow in his face. It's not working. <laughs> stop! Stop! Shut up, Smirnov! You don't understand me. If you turn it off, it's gonna blow. It's gonna blow. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <gasps> wow. He just saved your life. I mean, Steve and Robin kind of know a little bit of Russian. What, what the hell is happening? Whoa! Hello. What? What's going on oh, here? Right, Eleven's finding him, I think. Cool transition, <laughs> I but I thought everyone disappeared. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> what? Does it still hurt? What? Only when I talk. Billy's a dick. Well, it's a good thing you're not Mike then. Blah 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 blah. You'd be in constant pain. <laughs> <laughs> I like that they're friends again. I'm just, yeah. they're, they're good. We burn the shit out of him and make sure he doesn't escape this time. Okay, then what? Then we win. No, see, that's the problem. <laughs> There's always someone <laughs> else. I know. And he just came right back. We need to kill him. To kill him. We have to stop the mind flare. How in the hell did we do that? I don't know. Maybe Elle does. Mike, open the door. Nancy's here. They're not gonna get sick though in there. 
Susie, do you copy? <laughs> What does it look like I'm doing? I'm taking a leak. Look away. Oh my god! Oh, on the electrics. Steve, are you creep? Oh, oh. I'd love to see that. Okay, well, we don't even know what that is. Exactly. It could be useful. It could be radioactive. I know it's green. We've got company. Oh no. It could be good if they can like prepare cup. to attack whoever opens the door. Maybe they're hiding in the boxes. It's takes a piss in here. The <laughs> they should have hidden one of the boxes. Probably would have been smarter. Yeah, and you're ahead of the curve. Not this would have been the time. Oh, oh yes. yes, this is smart. How is how long is it gonna hold though? <laughs> if someone gets stuck. Wow. What the hell is that? He's still want to drink that? Yeah, imagine! Holy mother of She would have died! <laughs> what time was this attack? Last night. Right, but what time last night? Or around nine. She's flayed. Just like Billy. Flayed? The mind flayer. He flays people. Oh, is that what they're calling it? To do that, they basically become him. If there are two flayed, we have to assume there are more. Yeah. Heather. Bad screams. What's a good scream? Max said, doesn't matter. I'm sorry. <laughs> God, that, that pollution. God, yeah, I know. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. It's a pretty obvious indicator. <laughs> oh, we know those shoes. His walk. He like doesn't bend his knees when he walks. No, this is what makes me. That's why I said Terminator. It looks like it. I am not a mechanic. Yeah, clearly. That's why you should listen to Alexi. All right. Yeah. Your new boyfriend, right? Oh, oh are you jealous? God. He's running. <laughs> yeah, oh. Papa, come on. Son of a bitch. <laughs> 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 He's crazy. Oh, he's oh, he was running towards something. Oh, oh my god, oh. he's so good. Is it not suspicious? He's walking in with a guy in handcuffs. Yeah, and they all look a bit battered. I know. What the hell is wrong <laughs> with these people? It's a police emergency. All right. I need to commandeer your vehicle. What? Is, I what? There's a. I know he doesn't look it. But <laughs> he is one of the most dangerous men in the world. He's so cute, though. I know! It's like a child that's like in a candy store. Let's call the station. What station? Ooh, I like the sound of the <laughs> What station? You know what the light is? Yeah, poor Todd. Probably being used to make something. Or power something. Like a nuclear weapon. Totally. Mm -hmm. Walking towards a nuclear weapon. They're on the right track. That'd be great. Here. I mean, Hawkins. Seriously. Of all places. Use your prior knowledge, guys. You think the Russians know about the thick code? So it's connected. I know, the, the girls don't know how deep it goes. Oh. And if there's one thing we know about that signal, it could reach the surface. Shit. Okay. Heather? Oh, Jesus, it's freezing. He likes it cold. Telltale signs. I think they're guzzling this shit? Yeah, either that or they just went on <laughs> what a hell What the hell? Screen. Yesterday, Tom had a bandage on his forehead. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They could be like police when they grow up. They're solving a, a murder or a mystery. If they ever get to grow up, I feel like we could lose people by the end of the show. Oh, don't say that! Don't jinx it! I want them all here. Taking them somewhere. Where are they keeping the building? There must be a place where all this started, right? A source. Somewhere he didn't want me to see. If she wants to go back so badly, why don't we let her? Yeah, and follow her while you're at it. What are they about to do? Look at the camera. Murray. Identify yourselves. Oh, is this that weirdo Fire. that Jonathan and uh, Nancy talked to? <laughs> I feel like he could know Russian. What the hell? Привет из моего лица. Ты лысая американская свинья. Я там может и лысый. Oh, he does know it. I knew it. Can it be a swallow? Oh damn. Okay. He's very hyper aware. Yeah. Very uh, paranoid, I'd say. Brings airport down security. 
полегче. Молчать, сволочь. This is not gonna work. Mm. He's not eccentric. He's certifiable. Do me a favor and move your lover's quarrel elsewhere. Okay? Oh, oh. I think that's what Alexei's been <laughs> thinking still all day. Still firmly in denial. Stop behaving like a jackass and ask him <laughs> what he's doing that's making my magnets fall off my damn fridge. <laughs> Joyce, go on. I think that will be all then. <laughs> oh my god, what the hell is this? Um, military officials and everything. So what? The comms room. You saw the comms room? Correct. How did she see she that? Positive. The door was open for a second. Be a hundred different things. I'll take those odds. How are you gonna get up? I know. Her? What? <laughs> How have they not noticed that there's four kids here running around? How frick has no one spotted them? What good timing! Quick, quick, quick. quick. Hey. Yeah, I was thinking someone's <laughs> bound to be in here. Silver cat! He changed his mind on drawing the gun. <laughs> Whoa! You did it! <laughs> you you didn't know how dusty! I... <laughs> That's the first fight Steve's ever won! <laughs> yeah, literally! Holy shit. God, this is so out no. of our depth. Oh my god, it's like the lab reincarnated. Oh my god, they've got that really scary thing! Yeah, and that juice fuels it. This is not good. What would happen to you if you just waved your hand in front of it? <laughs> I was just going to they probably should have tried just one of them sneaky in there, not the whole horde. Yeah. Extended. I don't care who they are. two visitors at a time. I was just completely, utterly mortifyingly big words wrong we're both right in a way i just look forward to you never doubting me again yeah <laughs> and this is a big <laughs> i told you so for nancy right now yeah. oh, oh god she's already she? gone i don't know she's gone home oh <gasps> it's him he's making you do this god we need to get out of here Oh, he is sweaty. He is sweaty. <laughs> oh, oh no, the army is getting they've really They've got the big. Donald Trump guy as well. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> How'd they find the retro packaging? I know. I noticed that on the Coke cans earlier at the 7-Eleven. Like, like they've got really like the vintage logos and stuff. It's really cool. It was that easy. Eleven, come on, girl. Well, well, she doesn't know anything about relationships. She doesn't know she holds so much power right now. <laughs> this is terrible. Li literally. I hope the way they run for their lives and they just walk and somehow catch up. I don't care how good her pie is. Oh, for goodness sake. Come on, pick up <gasps> Oh. Oh, he's caught up. Oh, I don't like that guy, he's really creepy! That's a reference to The Shining, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I think it is. Jonathan just as powerless as he was in the workplace. No. Jonathan, oh, move! Oh, God! Ah. God, that must hurt so much. Oh, he's going to be out of action for a while. Ah, she's going to stab him with something. Ugh. I wonder why they didn't want Jonathan as well. Why did you get two for the price of one? Oh, that, God, that that's so <gasps> No! Oh. 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 oh! oh! Thank God they're tethered. Come on, Nancy! Stop! Stop! Stop. Come on, Nancy, you gotta kill it. No, Jonathan, Go Jonathan. Two. <laughs> Oh, the teamwork! Oh, Jonathan can oh. be broken bones and now, oh, like he can still do it. Ugh. Ugh. What is that? Ew. <gasps> the mouth. Ew. 
Ah, uh, but you don't want it touching you though. That's what the rat's turned into, isn't it? And it just slopes off. That's the mind flayer's goo. We follow that and we might find out where the hub is. Yeah, because that's where it's gonna go, isn't it? Does it just travel all the way through town though? <laughs> <laughs> is it gonna meet in the middle? <laughs> Cute! <Like> <laughs> What's happening? No, light! <laughs> oh my god, what the hell is that? <laughs> that's, a, that's something new, that's something new. Oh my god, ew. What the hell was that? <laughs> that was horrible. Oh, I'm little... going back. Ew, that was horrible. Oh, that's... <laughs> it's got like the spider legs and pincers almost. Had... Oh. Yeah, it's all sort of like two became one and it created like a yeah. demon. Mind Flayer thing, a love like, child. I don't know how the rest of the hospital don't know what's going on, like how noisy it is and the lights and everything. How has no one been alerted? It showed that they'd killed people though, didn't it? Like there was a patient dead on the floor and I think a worker as well, so they, they must have killed everyone on that floor or something. Yeah, it probably did. We're still none the wiser about the ins and outs of this Mind Flayer and what it can truly do. We're still in the early stages mm. so i don't even know what to suggest here like it's it's like manifesting into all different things and you know everyone's seen a bit of it and we've got the russians then we got this like it's got to connect and we're not quite there yet but i think we will be soon yeah i mean it definitely is starting to connect in some ways isn't it i wonder what happened to mrs driscoll well, we've got no answers as to what actually did happen about where she went. She either went to the source or those two guys sort of inhaled her innards, insides, and became two people in one. I don't know, like, maybe her goo came out and they swallowed it. Ew. <laughs> Sounds so gross. I like that they've combined Nancy and Jonathan, the kids' storylines, this early on, because usually that's like a penultimate episode kind of deal. Especially because Nancy and Jonathan were in the midst of an argument, and I also feel like their solo storyline this season wasn't as strong as it has been in previous seasons, so it's made it a bit more interesting. I agree. I think it's good that they combined Nancy and Jonathan's team with the kids, because last season, you know, we've seen before, they're very fragmented, they're all on their own little quests and you know I was dying for them all to like meet up in the middle because they got all these different bits of information, everyone together makes a good information pie, like it, like it just all comes together when they're together so it is good that Nancy and Jonathan have joined the kids because they're going to be a lot more invincible. It is interesting though, where do, the, where do they think Dustin is? They haven't tried to look for Dustin yet, usually when one of them is on the outskirts they always try and get a hang of that person because they're worried but they haven't tried to get hold of Dustin in episode, multiple episodes. So what do they think he's doing during all of this? They haven't even called him for like help or information. I feel for Dustin because I think he said before that he felt quite abandoned and mm. they don't really care like dustin could be saving the world right now and they don't even know yeah it, it's really odd like how they're not looking to search for him that they were concerned about joyce and hopper but they weren't with dustin like yeah i think it's probably because for the viewers they're in established groups and whatnot but it doesn't make sense for these characters not to be looking for him when it's every really... season he's always been a part of that team and for him to just be left out of that and not even be in contact if say he wasn't with Robin and Steve doing all this stuff and he was just at home on his own I think he'd feel really left out I'm hoping they get out of there eventually and they can meet up because they have a lot of good insightful knowledge because I don't think the kids really know about the Russian element to this whole mystery do they? no they know nothing about it like I mean, Hopper and Joyce know, um, mm -hmm. Dustin, Steve, the team, they know, but Eleven, Mike and all of that, Nancy, Jonathan, they don't know. So yeah, I think we need to combine again. Opened. And speaking of the Russians, I really like Alexi. <laughs> he's, he's grown on me, honestly. Like, he's quite, he's quite innocent in all <laughs> in his demeanour. Like, 
what he's doing is not innocent. He's a part of the team doing something terrible, opening the gate or whatever. Mm. But as a person, he is actually quite nice. <laughs> we don't really he, know much about him. I'm only going off the context clues in episode one where it looked like he was scared of the thing he'd created. So I'm thinking like he must be a good guy. But just this episode with him being so wholesome. <laughs> Yeah, it was he is. so cute. Him just sitting in the back of that car. He's a he's a child murderer, and then him just sitting there sipping from his slushy, having so absolutely cute. no idea what it means. I like, guess yeah. he can't understand. Um, yeah, it is quite interesting. I, I'm I'm really invested now that they're in Illinois and they're talking to that guy that can speak Russian. Like what they can they can actually talk to him next episode, hopefully. Like, they can understand what is going on. I mean, I don't know how much information he's going to say, but mm. it would be really useful to understand why this Russian team want to look so bad into the Upside Down world. Why tamper with something so dangerous? I, I don't know. The very first scene of the season, they showed them talking about it, didn't they? We'll have to go back and look, I think, because... I remember they killed that guy because something he'd done had failed and then they moved on to Alexi to create something. But I don't know what their aim... I don't know whether they said what their aim was or what they were trying to do. We'll have to have a look for the next Yeah, episode. I don't remember them saying their motive at all. And I find this whole chemical drinking interesting. And I think mm. it must be to do with that green liquid that powers the machinery yeah. that sends the electrical energy into the upside down they must have like a thirst for chemicals or something now because it's infiltrated the upside down maybe the origins i'd like to know as well like you say mm. it's like we don't know anything other than what we've seen and it's very little um how the mind flayer how he attracted billy like was was the goo just in there and it was like yep yeah, we'll chuck a rock at his car like was, was it was it in a person was it I don't know. I don't know Did the, the answer. Did from all those rats also turn into this thing? Yeah, the rats. What, what was going on there? Like, oh, I can't get a human. I'll get an animal. Like, it's it's really bizarre how it works. It can seem it seems to be able to go into anything, like human, animal, whatever. It can transfer its goo into it, and then it mm. takes it over. We're trying to make sense of something that does not make sense and is not real. So yes, That's it is why very I always difficult. Find the hardest to comprehend with this show is like the the origins of the monsters and the meanings behind it, the reasons they do what they do, but there isn't really much reason to it because they're monsters. <laughs> That's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching our reaction to season three, episode five of Stranger Things. If you want to watch our uncut reactions, the link to the Patreon page will be in the description below. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for episode six. Bye. Bye.